The year 2011 involved many significant scientific events, including the first artificial organ transplant, the launch of China's first space station and the growth of the world population to 7 billion. The year saw a total of 78 successful orbital spaceflights, as well as numerous advances in fields such as electronics, medicine, genetics, climatology and robotics. 2011 was declared the International Year of Forests and Chemistry by the United Nations. Events, discoveries and inventions Topic January the 3rd of January American pharmaceutical company Johnson and Johnson announces a partnership for the development of a test for the detection of metastatic cancer in the bloodstream Belfast Telegraph the independent the 5th of January researchers at the University of Pennsylvania find that a major cause of baldness may be related to the inability of some stem cells to grow into full-sized hair follicles Fox News J Clinton Invest, an engineer from the University of Missouri announces his ambition to create a flexible solar sheet of small nano antennas, capable of capturing solar energy with 90% efficiency. This would mark a significant improvement over contemporary commercial solar panels, which have an average efficiency of around 20%. J. Sol. Energy Eng, 6 January, the Journal of Personality and Social Psychology, a peer-reviewed journal of the American Psychological Association, announces that it will shortly publish a paper presenting strong evidence of ESP, the ability to sense future events. CBS ABC J. Peirce. Sock. Cycle, the 10th of January, Kepler 10b, the first confirmed small rocky exoplanet, is discovered in the Draco constellation using NASA's Kepler Space Telescope (BBC, NASA Astrophys). J, the 12th of January, researchers announce that salty junk food can damage arteries in as little as 30 minutes after being eaten. MSNBC, AM. J, Clin. NUTR, 14 January, a study conducted at the Innsbruck Medical University in Austria reveals that stainless steel or titanium tongue piercings harbor more bacteria than plastic piercings. Science News J. Adelesk. Health, the 15th of January, in a study funded by the U.S. National Cancer Institute, researchers reveal that smoking cigarettes can cause damages in the body in minutes rather than years. BBC Chem. Res. Toxical, the 18th of January, researchers in Australia announce that sharks are colorblind after examining the eyes of 17 separate shark species. BBC Naturwissenschaften, the 19th of January, a Cochrane Library review suggests that antioxidants may improve male fertility. BBC Cochrane DATB. Cyst. Rev. The 20th of January, a landmark study unveils a medical technique that renders T cells resistant to HIV. Daily Tech Hum Gene Therapy. The World Meteorological Organization concludes that 2010 was the joint hottest year on record. WMO scientists achieve 10 billion bits of quantum entanglement in silicon, a significant step in quantum computing. Nature, the 21st of January, an article in Science reveals the discovery of a Darwinopterus pterosaur in China with an unhatched egg, thereby allowing the genders to be differentiated. BBC Science, the 24th of January, researchers publish direct evidence that massive volcanic eruptions took place 250 million years ago, likely causing the Permian-Triassic extinction event, the biggest single extinction event in Earth's history. World.edu Nat. Geosci, an article in Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences reveals the discovery of Linhenicus monodactylus, an Alvarez saurid theropod dinosaur, in Inner Mongolia. Though a cousin to the giant Tyrannosaurus rex, it is no bigger than a modern parrot, and possesses only one claw on each forelimb. BBC PNAS scientists and students have built a 3D printer that makes edible food. CNN Money, the 27th of January, under pressure from industry and governments, the European Commission is putting the final touches on a strategy to reduce Europe's dependence on Chinese supplied rare earth metals, which are essential in export products like cars and electronics. New York Times, the 30th of January, molybdenite is revealed to be up to 100,000 times more efficient than silicon transistors and to have better electrical properties than graphene. Nat Nanotechnol. 
Topic: February. The 2nd of February, the Linach coherent light source, an X-ray source a billion times brighter than previous sources, becomes operational at Stanford University. The device could potentially revolutionize 3D bioanalysis techniques, especially in the analysis of proteins and viruses. Stanford. The 3rd of February. A blood test to detect VCJD is developed by British scientists, who say it could identify healthy people who are carriers of the disease. BBC The Lancet Further data from the Kepler Space Telescope published in Nature reveals that the star Kepler 11, located 2,000 light years from Earth, has a solar system including six planets, which range between two and four and a half times the radius of Earth, and between two and thirteen times its mass. Five orbit the star closer than Mercury orbits our Sun, and all are likely to have atmospheres made of light gases, and to be too hot to support life. The data also includes details of more than 1,000 additional exoplanet candidates. BBC Nature. The 4th of February, scientists reveal a tiny artificial brain derived from rat neurons that exhibits 12 seconds of short-term memory. Popshi Lab on a chip. The 7th of February, scientists at Oxford University successfully test a universal flu vaccine, which should work against all known strains of the illness. The Guardian, Plin. Infect. Dis. The 9th of February, using 25 years of evidence from over 470,000 participants, researchers show that sleep deprivation and disrupted sleep patterns can have long-term, serious health implications. EUR. Heart J. The 10th of February, scientists identify the root molecular cause of a variety of illnesses brought on by advanced age, including waning energy, failure of the heart and other organs, and metabolic disorders such as diabetes. Nature The 11th of February, scientists show that stem cells delivered via a nasal spray lead to an improvement of motor functions in rats with Parkinson's disease-like symptoms. Neuroscience News Rejuven. Res. 15 February In a world first for artificial intelligence, IBM's Watson supercomputer defeats two humans on the Jeopardy! quiz show, Wired. Scientists report stimulation of mouse muscle fibers in a way similar to the regeneration of severed limbs in newts and salamanders. Medical Daily ACS Chem. Biol. The 16th of February, researchers find a way of manipulating tiny swimming robots, just 1.3 mm long, using electric currents in water. New Scientist, American Physical Society. The 17th of February, scientists build the world's first anti-laser, capable of absorbing an incoming laser beam entirely. BBC Science. A hummingbird-like nano-air vehicle is demonstrated for the first time, in an attempt to secure a DARPA contract to create small surveillance aircraft. Aerovironment The 20th of February, Stanford University researchers create new stretchable solar cells that could power artificial electronic super skin, capable of detecting chemicals and biological molecules. The potential applications include clothing, robotics, prosthetic limbs and more. Stanford AAAS, the 21st of February, new research indicates that bilingual speakers are better at multitasking, because they are better at editing out irrelevant information. This overturns previous assumptions of bilingualism causing confusion, especially in children. Penn State AAAS. The 22nd of February. The first complete millimeter scale computing system is developed, ISSCC. Chinese scientists calculate a quantum law of protein folding that explains the impact of temperature on folding. Techview, Arxiv. The first full-color quantum dot display prototype is unveiled by Samsung, Techview, Nat. Photon. The 28th of February. Scientists at Yale University demonstrate that bulk metallic glasses BMGs can be blow molded into shapes that would be impossible with normal metals without loss in strength or durability. Mater. Today, a pacemaker the size of a Tic Tac is announced by Medtronic. Techview. Topic. March. 
the 1st of March UK researchers demonstrate an optical microscope with one of the highest resolutions yet achieved capable of imaging objects as little as 50 nanometers across BBC Nat Commune Scientists have determined how to generate a backward pulling force from a forward propagating beam effectively creating a form of tractor beam Techview Arxiv Swiss researchers discover a gene in wasps that allow them to reproduce asexually cur Biol. The 4th of March. Researchers transform a human embryonic stem cell into a critical type of neuron that dies early in Alzheimer's disease and is a major cause of memory loss. The discovery may have major implications in the treatment of the disease. Machines like us, stem cells. A groundbreaking study of mice indicates the liver, not the brain, could be the source of amyloid brain plaques associated with Alzheimer's disease. J. Neurosci. Res. The 5th of March, the United States Air Force launches its robotic Boeing X-37 spaceplane on its second long-duration spaceflight. The spaceplane ultimately remains in orbit for 469 days. Bloomberg. The 8th of March, the world's first tissue-engineered urethras are successfully used. BBC. The Lancet. The 12th of March, surgeons in Houston, Texas, successfully implant the world's first continuous flow artificial heart in a human patient. The turbine-based device is efficient and long-lived, and may herald the mass production of smaller and more durable alternatives to conventional artificial hearts. Houston Chronicle. The 14th of March, archaeologists believe that they have found the lost city of Atlantis in mud swamps near Cadiz, Spain. They theorize that a tsunami struck the ancient settlement. A television special on the National Geographic Channel later investigates their findings. MSNBC, Fox News. The 16th of March, scientists report the first successful use of microcarriers to bring anti-cancer drugs to the targeted area in the liver of a living rabbit. Biomaterials. The 18th of March, NASA's Messenger spacecraft successfully enters orbit around the planet Mercury, the first probe to do so. BBC. The 20th of March, a new way of delivering drugs to the brain using the body's own exosomes is developed by scientists, overcoming a major barrier to the delivery of potential new drugs for many neurological diseases, including Alzheimer's. BBC. Nat. Biotechnol. Researchers announce the development of a three-dimensional nanostructure for battery cathodes that allows for dramatically faster charging, without sacrificing energy storage capacity. This could lead to cell phones that charge in seconds, and electric cars that charge in minutes. NAT. Nanotechn. A new way of making battery electrodes, based on nanostructured metal foams, can be used to make a lithium-ion battery that recharge by 90% in under two minutes. Techview Nat. Nanotechn. Scientists demonstrate how SHANK3, a brain protein, may trigger autism-like behavior in mice by stopping effective communication between brain cells. BBC Nature. The 22nd of March, a 6cm by 6cm chip holding nine quantum devices, among them four quantum bits, is demonstrated at the American Physical Society meeting in Dallas, Texas. It is hoped that further scaling up to 10 qubits should be possible later this year. BBC American Physical Society The 24th of March A landmark study indicates that pioglitazone prevents the development of type 2 diabetes in 72% of pre-diabetic subject participants, the largest such decrease yet demonstrated by any intervention. Daily Tech NEJM The first sperm cells are grown in a lab the independent nature the 27th of march harvard university scientists demonstrate use of an electric field to extinguish an open flame more than 1 foot tall a development they say could yield fire suppression alternatives to water and chemical retardants cnn american chemical society the 31st of march scientists announce the successful controlled entanglement of 14 quantum bits qubits realizing the largest quantum register yet produced nearly double the previous record for the number of entangled quantum bits realized zdnet fizz rev let 
Topic: April. The 4th of April. A human heart is grown in a laboratory from stem cells, marking a major advance in personalized medicine. Five more genes which increase the risk of developing Alzheimer's have been identified, taking the number of genes linked to the disease to 10. BBC Nat. Janet. A meta-study indicates that people with autism process visual information differently from neurotypical people. CBC Medical News Today Hum. Brain Map. A particle accelerator in the United States shows compelling hints of a never-before-seen particle. Researchers say it could be the most significant discovery in physics in half a century. Popshi BBC Arcs of Fizz. Rev. Let. The 5th of April. Scientists develop a novel approach to inhibiting angiogenesis for cancer treatment. Clin. Cancer Res. The Russian Federal Space Agency announces a joint plan with NASA to develop a future nuclear-powered rocket, Fast Company. The 6th of April, Japanese scientists announce that they have created working retinas from mouse stem cells. BBC Nature News. The 12th of April. According to a controversial study, the aging process can be reduced by increasing telomere lengths without cancer risk. The Daily Beast aging cell. Scientists produce the first comprehensive analysis of the greenhouse gas footprint of shale gas, concluding that its environmental impact is worse than coal. BBC Klim. Change The 13th of April Cell phones may be contributing to a global decline in honeybee populations, according to researchers. Toronto Star Apodology. American scientists discover that light can demonstrate strong magnetic effects when traveling through certain materials at certain intensities. This finding, which overturns a century-old scientific assumption that light's magnetic effects are too weak to be tangible, may lead to the development of solar panels capable of storing energy magnetically. Michigan Today The 14th of April more than 1,000 UK patients with advanced pancreatic cancer have joined a trial using a new vaccine to treat the disease. BBC Shrinkage in parts of the brain of some Alzheimer's disease sufferers can be detected up to a decade before symptoms appear. BBC Neurology The 15th of April the world's first human brain map is unveiled, providing an interactive research tool that will help scientists to understand how the brain works. The map is hoped to aid new discoveries in disease and treatments. 1,000 anatomical sites in the brain can be searched, supported by more than 100 million data points that indicate the gene expression and biochemistry of each site. New scientist. The 17th of April, researchers have injected biodegradable nanofiber spheres carrying cells into wounds to grow tissue. Nat. Mater. The 18th of April, scientists demonstrate mathematically that asymmetrical materials should be possible. Such material would allow most light or sound waves through in one direction, while preventing them from doing so in the opposite direction. Such materials would allow the construction of true one-way mirrors, soundproof rooms, or even quantum computers that use light to perform calculations. Phys. Rev. Let. A new design for thin film solar cells has been developed that requires significantly less silicon than standard models, and may be more efficient at capturing solar energy. APPL. Fizz. Let. The 19th of April, an international research team publishes a new method to produce belts of graphene, called nanoribbons. By using hydrogen, they have managed to transform single walled carbon nanotubes into ribbons. ACS Nano. The 20th of April, scientists describe a Chinese spider they say is the biggest fossilized arachnid yet found, Nephila jurassica, as they have called the specimen, would have had a leg span of some 15 cm. BBC Biol. Let The 21st of April, scientists successfully cause a modified anti-malaria gene to spread amongst a population of mosquitoes, BBC Nature. Researchers have built a carbon nanotube synapse circuit whose behavior in tests reproduces the function of a neuron, the building block of the human brain, LISA. 
Israeli engineers have built an artificial device capable of detecting cancers of the head and neck by analyzing breath. Medical Express BR. J. Cancer The 22nd of April, gene transcription is observed in real time in a live cell. U.S. News & World Report Techno-Science.net Science the 24th of April, small lasers capable of igniting a fuel-air mixture more efficiently, resulting in less pollution, may replace spark plugs in gasoline engines. BBC Clio Opt. Express The 25th of April Some microbes can survive gravity more than 400,000 times that felt on Earth, a new study says. By contrast, most humans can tolerate three to five times Earth's surface gravity before losing consciousness. National Geographic, PNAS. The European Commission has approved plans to build a trio of lasers that will each dwarf the power of any previous laser. The project, called the Extreme Light Infrastructure, will lay the groundwork for building an even more powerful laser that could try to pull virtual particles out of the vacuum of spacetime. New scientist. 28 April Researchers publish findings of three more genes linked to the most common form of breast cancer, which could provide targets for new treatments. Daily Telegraph plus Genet. According to an American Physical Society report, technologies for removing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere are unlikely to offer an economically feasible way to slow human-driven climate change for several decades. New York Times APS. Topic May. The 1st of May. Researchers successfully store a qubit in a single atom by writing the quantum state of single photons into a rubidium atom and reading it out again later. Nature. A Detroit entrepreneur has invented a heat treatment that makes steel 7% stronger than any steel on record in less than 10 seconds. Mater. Psi. Technol. 3 May Middle-aged people who are overweight but not obese are 71% more likely to develop dementia than those with a normal weight, according to new research, links between obesity and dementia had previously been found. BBC Neurology Scientists have used nanoscale capsules to release an immune system stimulating protein directly into lung cancer tumors. PLOS One Australian researchers say they are a step closer to finding a vaccine for HIV, and hope to be able to offer a preventative jab by 2020. Sydney Morning Herald PNAS. The 4th of May Yukon fossils may represent the first early traces of biomineralization in eukaryotes, wired geology. Experimental data gathered by the Gravity Probe B satellite confirms two aspects of the general theory of relativity, which was published by Albert Einstein in 1916. BBC Arxiv Phys. Rev. Let. CERN scientists have confined antihydrogen atoms for 1,000 seconds, four orders of magnitude longer than has ever been achieved before in capturing and maintaining antimatter atoms. Arxiv. Intel unveils its next generation of microprocessor technology, codenamed Ivy Bridge. The upcoming chips will be the first to use a 22 nanometers manufacturing process, which packs transistors more densely than the current 32 nanometers system, providing greater efficiency. BBC Intel. The 6th of May. A new study suggests that the drop in production of neurons in old age is due to the shrinking cache of adult stem cells in our brains. Times of India cell stem cell A machine used for measuring impurities in semiconductors can be used to analyze immune cells in far more detail than has been previously possible, researchers from Stanford University have shown. Chemistry World Science Researchers have identified a group of mitochondrial proteins, the absence of which allows other protein groups to stabilize the genome. This could delay the onset of age-related diseases and increase lifespan. Economic Times Mol. Cell. The 9th of May, smog-eating aluminium panels which clean themselves and the air around them are unveiled, their titanium dioxide coating, when combined with sunlight, acts as a catalyst to break down pollutants into harmless matter that rain washes away. 
Alcoa, USA Today, Forbes via MSNBC. The 11th of May, a new phylum of fungi is announced and named Cryptomycota, hidden fungi. BBC Nature, a new vaccine can protect macaques against the monkey equivalent of HIV and could provide a fresh approach to an HIV vaccine, a study suggests. BBC Nature. D-Wave Systems, after some 12 years of research, the accumulation of 60 patents, and the filing of 100 more, has released the world's first commercial quantum computer, priced at $10 million. Forbes, Extreme Tech, D-Wave. The 12th of May, the exoplanet Gliese 581d can be considered the first confirmed exoplanet that could potentially support Earth-like life, according to a team of French scientists. Astrophys. J. Let. The 13th of May. New results from mice cast doubts on hopes for self transplants generated from the receiver's stem cells, as such transplants can be rejected by the immune system. New scientist, Nature. According to new research, a small set of genes located within the mitochondria of cells is crucial to unraveling the secrets of male infertility. Medical Express, Science. The discovery of a new physical phenomenon could yield transistors with greatly enhanced capacitance, a measure of the voltage required to move a charge. This, in turn, could lead to the revival of clock speed as the measure of a computer's power. Science Contaminated water can be cleaned much more effectively using a novel, cheap material, which could offer a low cost way to purify water in the developing world. BBC ACSAPPL. Meta. Interfaces. 15 May, researchers have found that KLF-14, a gene linked to type 2 diabetes and cholesterol levels, is in fact a «master regulator» gene, which controls the behavior of other genes found within fat in the body. Medical Express Nat. Janet. The 16th of May, NASA's Space Shuttle Endeavour launches on its final mission, BBC. The 18th of May, Scientists have achieved invisibility in the visible light range of the spectrum. Opt. Let. Rogue planets lacking parent stars may outnumber normal exoplanets by at least 50%, and are nearly twice as common in our galaxy as main sequence stars, according to a new study, Space.com, Arcsiv, Nature. The 19th of May. By using electrical stimulation of the spinal cord, a man from Oregon who became paralyzed after being hit by a car can stand and move his legs on his own. BBC The Lancet Scientists have developed an open-source desktop genome analyzer. It works in conjunction with a browser that allows biologists to rapidly and easily analyze and process their high-throughput information. TG Daily Bioinformatics the 20th of May, a highly developed sense of smell kick started the evolution of mammals' big brains, according to new research. BBC Nature News Science. The 23rd of May, researchers have set a new record for the rate of data transfer using a single laser, 26 terabits per second. BBC Nat. Photon. The bacteria responsible for stomach ulcers have been linked to Parkinson's disease, according to American researchers, BBC, ASM. The 24th of May, a superhot substance recently made in the Large Hadron Collider is the densest form of matter ever observed, scientists have announced. National Geographic. The 25th of May. Re-examination of data indicates that the gamma-ray burst GRB 090423 may be the most distant single object yet detected. Scientists believe the blast, which was detected by NASA's Swift Observatory, occurred a mere 520 million years after the Big Bang. BBC Arcs of Astrophys. J. NASA ends its operational planning activities for the veteran Mars rover Spirit. It will now transition the Mars Exploration Rover project to a single rover operation focused on Spirit's still active twin, Opportunity, Los Angeles Times, NASA. Swedish scientists unveil a technique that causes the brain to misinterpret the size of the human body, MSNBC plus 1. The 26th of May Stanford University researchers have managed to turn human skin cells directly into neurons, without first turning them into pluripotent stem cells. 
discover nature researchers believe they have made the first experimental observation of the dynamical Casimir effect using a rapidly moving mirror that turns virtual photons into real ones technology review Arxiv. the 29th of May human organs could be grown inside pigs for use in transplant operations following research using stem cells the Telegraph EHGC 2001 the 31st of May a team of Chinese physicists successfully entangles eight photons simultaneously and observes them in action. The previous record was six. Arxiv Researchers have demonstrated the first true nanoscale waveguides for next generation on chip optical communication systems. This holds potential for nanoscale photonic applications such as intra chip optical communication, signal modulation, nanoscale lasers, and biomedical sensing. NAT. Commune a NASA-led research team unveils the most precise map ever produced of the carbon stored in Earth's tropical forests. The data is expected to provide a baseline for ongoing carbon monitoring and research. PNAS. Topic June the 1st of June elements 114 and 116 are officially added to the periodic table, becoming its heaviest members yet. New scientist IUPAC pure APPL Chem scientists have discovered a worm that is the deepest living animal known to science, surviving in 48 degrees Celsius (118 Fahrenheit) water at depths of 1.3 kilometers (0.81 miles). BBC Nature, the 2nd of June, a team of students at the University of California is developing a first of its kind phase change memory solid state storage device that provides performance thousands of times faster than a conventional hard drive and up to 7 times faster than current state of the art solid state drives. Jacobs School of Engineering, the 3rd of June, researchers have bent one of the most basic rules of quantum mechanics by succeeding in observing light behaving as both a wave and a particle. BBC Science Six men in the Mars 500 facility near Moscow have now been in isolation for exactly 365 days, simulating a manned mission to Mars. New Scientist ESA About one in ten rocky planets around stars like the Sun may host a moon proportionally as large as Earth's. BBC Arxiv Icarus The 6th of June, a team of Virginia Commonwealth University scientists has discovered a new class of superatoms, a stable cluster of atoms that can mimic different elements of the periodic table with unusual magnetic characteristics PNAS the 7th of June fragrance clothing triggered by scent molecules that are stable in the dark and only release their aroma when exposed to light has been described in a thesis written by scientist Dr Olga Hinzer of Cologne University Henkel the 8th of June China's carbon dioxide emissions rose 10.4% in 2010 compared with the previous year as global emissions rose at the fastest rate for more than four decades, according to data released by BP, Reuters BP, the 9th of June researchers have achieved a breakthrough in antibacterial science, identifying natural ingredients capable of eradicating bacteria that have developed resistance to antibiotics. TNO type 2 diabetes, previously regarded as inevitably progressive, is successfully reversed in a group of newly diagnosed patients by an extreme eight-week diet of 600 calories a day. BBC Diabetologia the 10th of June cross checks on data that hinted at the discovery of a new subatomic particle have failed to find support for the observation BBC Arxiv Phys. Rev Let US scientists publish data about how nicotine acts as an appetite suppressant a finding that could help in fighting obesity Sunday Morning Herald Science, the 12th of June, the Nabro volcano begins to erupt, releasing the highest quantity of sulfur dioxide ever observed by satellite. Earthquake-report.com, the 13th of June, a study suggests that protostars may be seeding the universe with water. These stellar embryos shoot jets of material from their north and south poles as their growth is fed by infalling dust, which circles the bodies in vast disks. National Geographic Astron, and Astrophys, the 14th of June a study reveals that, on average, three to five days of global human activity produces the equivalent amount of carbon dioxide that volcanoes produce globally each year. 
U.S. Geological Survey Ten new planets outside our solar system have been spotted by the French-led Coro satellite, bringing the total number of known exoplanets to 561. BBC A Japanese experiment sees hints that neutrino particles can oscillate between all three types, opening new lines of research to test why matter became more prevalent than antimatter in the Big Bang. BBC Arxiv Phys. Rev. Let, 15 June, a central lunar eclipse takes place, with a totality of 1 hour and 40 minutes. Herald Sun 16 June, researchers have developed a scalable approach to fabricating high-speed graphene transistors. Nano Let 17 June The United States Department of Energy reports that it will invest $150 million in a private company that has developed a silicon wafer solar cell that can be manufactured twice as cheaply as standard solar cells. Huffington Post Thousands of insects are being lined up to have their genomes sequenced. The five-year project will help researchers pinpoint vulnerable regions of insects' genomes, which could be targeted with pesticides. BBC Entomological Society of America Scientists have developed a nano device that powers itself by harvesting energy from vibrations, while at the same time transmitting data wirelessly with a range of up to 10 meters (33 feet). Popshi Nano Let. 19 June Researchers have used a human vaccine to cure prostate cancer in mice. Medical Express Nat. Med. The oceans are in a worse state than previously suspected, with a mass extinction of marine species looming, according to a new report. BBC Ipso. 20 June, a Japanese computer has taken first place on the top 500 supercomputer list, ending China's reign at the top after just six months. Capable of operating at 8.16 petaflops quadrillion floating point calculations per second, the K computer is more powerful than the next five systems combined, ComputerWorld. The 22nd of June, a newly developed multiferroid composite of nickel, cobalt, manganese and tin can be either non-magnetic or highly magnetic, depending on its temperature, making it capable of converting heat into electricity, Popshi ADV. Energy mat. The brains of people living in cities operate differently from those in rural areas, according to a brain scanning study. The Guardian Nature Scientists demonstrate an acoustic cloaking device that makes objects invisible to sound waves such acoustic cloaking was proposed theoretically in 2008 but has only this year been put into practice bbc phys rev let stanford university researchers have developed a new method of attaching nanowire electronics to the surface of virtually any object regardless of its shape or composition the method could be used in making everything from wearable electronics and flexible computer displays to high-efficiency solar cells and ultra-sensitive biosensors, nano-let. The 23rd of June, single-celled yeast has been observed to evolve into a multicellular organism, complete with division of labor between cells. This suggests that the evolutionary leap to multicellularity may be a surprisingly small hurdle, new scientist, PNAS, 24 24th of June a tiny biological fuel cell powered by bacteria with a capacity of just 0.3 microliters has been built by researchers at Carnegie Mellon University CMU the new device the size of a single strand of human hair generates energy from the metabolism of bacteria on thin gold plates in micro manufactured channels Engadget biotechnol bioeng Biologists publish the explanation for yeast cells reversing aging. Science The 25th of June, Stanford researchers have developed a microphone that can be used at any depth in the ocean, even under crushing pressure, and is sensitive to a wide range of sounds, from a whisper in a library to an explosion of TNT. They modeled their device after the extraordinarily acute hearing of orcas. J. Acoust. Sock. Am. The 26th of June. A new gene editing technique provides the first published successful healing of a genetic condition in a live animal, by curing mice of hemophilia B. The Guardian Nature News Nature. Osteplana 065 meteorite is found in Sweden. Meteoritical Bulletin 
The 27th of June, a new bacterium is reported to have been produced from an engineered DNA sequence, in which thymine was replaced by the synthetic building block 5 chlorouracil, a substance toxic to other organisms. Angu. Chem. The 28th of June, the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization holds a ceremony in Rome, declaring the once widespread cattle disease rinderpest to be globally eradicated. New York Times, FAO. The 30th of June, Computer Corporation IBM develops a form of instantaneous memory, 100 times faster than flash memory. Engadget. Topic: <laughs> July. The 1st of July, based on results from the Tevatron particle accelerator, scientists have reported stronger evidence that a small excess of matter over antimatter was present during the Big Bang as particles decayed. BBC Fizz. Rev. D. The 3rd of July. China's monopoly over rare earth metals could be challenged by the discovery of massive deposits of these widely used minerals on the floor of the Pacific Ocean, a new study suggests. Nat. Geosci Warming oceans will melt glaciers quicker than expected, according to a new study. As oceans heat up, they could erode ice sheets much faster than warmer air alone. Liver science. Nat. Geosci The 7th of July Surgeons in Sweden have carried out the world's first synthetic organ transplant, using an artificial windpipe coated in stem cells. BBC Karolinska Hospital Global investment in renewable energy sources grew by 32% during 2010 to reach a record level of $211 billion, according to a UN study. Reportedly, the main drivers of investment growth were wind farms in China and rooftop solar panels in Europe, BBC, UNEP. The molecular basis for the breakage of DNA, an important process in the development of cancer, has been identified by Hebrew University of Jerusalem scientists. The Jerusalem Post Mol. Cell. The 9th of July, researchers have reprogrammed brain cells to become heart cells, PNAS. The 10th of July, an international team of scientists based in Scotland have decoded the full DNA sequence of the potato, one of the world's most important staple crops, for the first time. BBC Nature. The 12th of July, a computer has learned language by playing strategy games, inferring the meaning of words without human supervision. MIT ACL. Researchers at the University of Cambridge have identified a part of the brain associated with empathy which may be a biomarker for a familial risk of autism. Transal. Psychiatry. The planet Neptune completes its first orbit since it was discovered in 1846. The 13th of July. A string of a dozen underwater volcanoes, several of them active, has been found near Antarctica, the first such discovery in that region. Yahoo! Technicians from Kagawa University demonstrate a bionic mouth that replicates almost all the human organs that are required for singing. IEEE Spectrum The 14th of July, a fountain of youth that sustains the production of new neurons in the brains of rodents may also be present in the human brain, researchers have found. Neuron The 16th of July NASA's Dawn probe enters orbit around the asteroid 4 Vesta, BBC, NASA. Japanese company Sumitomo Electric Industries develops a new material which they believe can improve the range of electric vehicles by 300%. In Habitat, Suitomo Electric. The 19th of July. Russia's Radioastron, the largest orbital radio telescope yet constructed, is successfully launched into Earth orbit. BBC it is announced the Herschel Space Observatory has discovered a dense ribbon of gas and dust more than 600 light years across at the center of the Milky Way galaxy. Herschel The 20th of July The Hubble Space Telescope discovers another moon orbiting Pluto, IAU. An experiment at the Fermi National Accelerator Laboratory has revealed a heavy relative of the neutron. Liver Science Fermilab Phys. Rev. Let. The world's most powerful split magnet, 
one that is made in two halves with holes in the middle to observe experiments, has been built in the U.S. It operates at 25 Tesla, equivalent to 500,000 times the strength of Earth's magnetic field. BBC The 21st of July Space Shuttle Atlantis completes STS-135, the 135th and final mission of the Space Shuttle program, Spaceflight Now. A 120-million-year-old fossil is the oldest pregnant lizard ever discovered, according to scientists. The fossil, found in China, is a very complete 30 cm long specimen with more than a dozen embryos in its body. BBC Naturwissenschaften Researchers at the University of Minnesota have discovered a gene required to maintain male gender throughout life. Medical Express Nature The 26th of July Using silicon lithography, liquid silicone, and electrodes that are fashioned into patterns invisible to the naked eye, researchers at Stanford University have created transparent electric batteries. Technology Review PNAS DNA circuits have been used to make a neural network and to store memories. Ars Technica Nature The 28th of July, a Chinese fossil of a previously unknown bird-like dinosaur is estimated by scientists to be about 155 million years old, 5 million years older than Archaeopteryx, which for 150 years has been assumed to be the world's earliest bird. Daily Telegraph Nature the 29th of July, a major clinical trial will investigate whether stem cells can be safely used to stop or even reverse the damage caused by multiple sclerosis. BBC. Topic: <laughs> August. The 3rd of August, researchers suggest that Earth once had a small second moon that was destroyed in a slow motion collision with the far side of its larger companion. BBC Nature. The 4th of August, new images from the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter appear to show evidence of flowing liquid water on Mars. BBC Science. A ring of antiprotons is detected around the Earth. New scientist, next big future astrophys. J. Let Artificial sperm are created using stem cells for the first time, in a scientific breakthrough that could lead to new treatments for infertile men. Daily Telegraph Cell. The 5th of August The solar-powered probe Juno is launched from Kennedy Space Center on a five-year mission to Jupiter, BBC NASA. Bypassing stem cells, scientists have made neurons directly from human skin, Cell. Scientists have developed a new class of molecules that target cells' entry systems to ensure harmful organisms do not gain access. The molecules, nicknamed pitstops, could lead to new therapeutic approaches to prevent the spread of viral and bacterial infections. ABC Science Cell. The 6th of August, a study postulates that the demise of the world's forests 250 million years ago was likely accelerated by aggressive tree-killing fungi, who flourished in conditions brought about by global climate change. Geology The 8th of August, a report, based on NASA analysis of meteorites found on Earth, suggests that the building blocks of DNA adenine, guanine and related organic molecules may have been formed in outer space. PNAS The 10th of August, a new gene therapy that has successfully neutralized advanced cases of chronic lymphocytic leukemia in three patients is published. Fox News NEJM Scientific American The 11th of August Researchers say they have created the first ever animal with artificial information in its genetic code. The technique, they say, could give biologists atom by atom control over the molecules in living organisms. BBC J. Am. Chem. Sock. Arctic ice might be thinning four times faster than predicted by the IPCC, according to a new study by MIT's Department of Earth, Atmosphere, and Planetary Sciences EAPS, MIT, J. Geophys. Res. Scientists have shown how an enzyme from a microbe can quickly and cheaply produce hydrogen from water. Hydrogen is seen as vital to future energy systems, but its production has previously been too costly and time-consuming to be viable on a large scale. 
BBC Science. The 12th of August, an ultra-thin, flexible electronic circuit that can be stuck to the skin like a temporary tattoo is developed, with possible applications in cell phone and mobile computing technology. The Independent Science. The 16th of August. Private donors, including actress Jodie Foster, raise enough money to reopen the mothballed SETI radio telescope array, allowing SETI to continue its search for extraterrestrial intelligence. BBC A study of fossilized plants suggests that woody plants first appeared on the Earth about 10 million years earlier than previously thought. BBC Science Taiwanese researchers report that 15 minutes of exercise a day can boost life expectancy by three years and cut death risk by 14%. BBC The Lancet The 17th of August DARPA is offering $500,000 to study what it would take — organizationally, technically, sociologically and ethically — to send humans to another star, a challenge of such magnitude that the study alone could take a hundred years. New York Times Researchers at the University of Edinburgh state that near-death experiences are the work of neural pathway disturbances caused by a disruption of the oxygen supply to the brain, and are not supernatural events. Scientific American Trends COGN. Sci. The 18th of August IBM has developed a microprocessor which it claims comes closer than ever to replicating the human brain. The system is capable of rewiring its connections as it encounters new information, similar to the way biological synapses work. BBC Com. ACM Within decades, solar storms are likely to become more disruptive to planes and spacecraft, say researchers at Reading University, BBC Geophys. Res. Let. The 19th of August, the U.S. Office of Naval Research says that it has successfully tested a new type of explosive material that can dramatically increase weapons impacts. Missiles made from the high-density substance can explode with up to five times the energy of existing explosives. BBC. The 22nd of August, American researchers prototype a basic form of bulletproof skin based on genetically modified silkworm threads. Police one. The 23rd of August The natural world contains about 8.7 million species, according to a new estimate described by scientists as the most accurate ever. However, the vast majority of these species have not been identified, cataloging them all could take more than 1,000 years. BBC plus Biol Computer simulations suggest that violent asteroid impacts flinging life from Earth to other planets is more likely than previously thought. BBC Arxiv. The 24th of August, antibiotics impact on gut bacteria is permanent and so serious in its long-term consequences that medicine should consider whether to restrict the prescription of antibiotics to pregnant women and young children, according to a new study. Wired Nature. The 25th of August, a monkey sporting a ginger beard and matching fiery red tail, discovered in a threatened region of the Brazilian Amazon, is believed to be a species new to science. The Guardian The 26th of August, an atomic clock at the UK's National Physical Laboratory NPL, has the best long-term accuracy of any clock in the world, researchers from NPL and Penn State University have found. BBC Metrologia the 29th of August, Japanese scientists announce an innovation in wind turbine technology, the wind lens, which could triple the energy output of wind turbines, making wind energy effectively cheaper than nuclear energy. Mother Nature Network, Kyushu University. The 31st of August, an engineered virus injected into the blood can selectively target and destroy cancer cells throughout the body, in what researchers have labeled a medical first. BBC Nature A pill to prevent sunburn is being developed, using coral's natural defense against the sun's harmful ultraviolet rays. BBC Graphene, the strongest known material on Earth, could help boost broadband internet speed, say researchers. BBC AMD has broken the world overclocking speed record, thanks to the use of liquid nitrogen and liquid helium coolant. 
The company achieved an overclocked frequency of 8.429 GHz on a near production, 8 core AMD FX 8150 bulldozer processor sample. A weak Europe. September The 2nd of September Researchers create the smallest electric motor yet devised, made from a single molecule around a nanometer across. The invention could have applications in both nanotechnology and medicine. BBC Nat. Nanotechn Researchers report two major breakthroughs in quantum computing a quantum system built on the familiar von Neumann processor memory architecture, and a working digital quantum simulator built on a quantum computer platform. Popshi Science 1 Science 2 Yale University researchers have discovered the source of signals that trigger hair growth, an insight that may lead to new treatments for baldness, cell, Scientists map the taste cortex in mice, pinpointing the brain regions that detect certain flavors. Popshi Science Researchers suggest that dry desert planets might be the most common type of habitable planet in the galaxy, rather than watery planets such as Earth. Astrobiology. The 8th of September. Cuban medical authorities release Cimavax EGF, the first therapeutic vaccine for lung cancer. The vaccine was the result of a 25-year research project at Havana's Center of Molecular Immunology, Xinhua. University of Glasgow scientists have taken the first tentative steps towards creating life from inorganic chemical cells ICHLs, potentially defining the new area of inorganic biology. New scientist Angu Chem. The 9th of September, feeding a supercomputer with news stories could help predict major world events, according to U.S. researchers. BBC First Monday. The 12th of September. Arctic sea ice has melted to a historic low, researchers from the University of Bremen in Germany report. CNN AMSRE. Astronomers using the European Southern Observatory's HARPS instrument announce the discovery of more than 50 new exoplanets, including 16 super-Earths, with one planet reportedly orbiting at the edge of the habitable zone of its star. By studying the properties of all the HARPS planets found so far, the team has found that about 40% of stars similar to our Sun have at least one planet lighter than Saturn, ESO. The 13th of September The relative risks to the supply of some of Earth's rarest elements have been detailed in a new list published by the British Geological Survey BGS, BBC, BGS. Researchers have developed a sophisticated camera system able to detect lies by watching facial movements during speech. BBC The 14th of September NASA unveils the design for a new heavy lift rocket to take humans to Mars and the asteroids. BBC Researchers may have discovered how to safely open and close the blood-brain barrier, offering a new way to safely deliver therapies to treat Alzheimer's disease, multiple sclerosis and cancers of the central nervous system directly to the brain. Medical Express J. Neurosci The 15th of September, a piece of amber discovered in Alberta, Canada, contains an 80-million-year-old feather that could provide clues to the relationship between dinosaurs and modern avian species. CBC Science The 16th of September Scientists' predictions about the formation and characteristics of dark matter have been shaken by research into dwarf galaxies surrounding the Milky Way BBC Artificial blood vessels made on a 3D printer may soon be used for transplants of lab created organs BBC the 19th of September, people with schizophrenia are six times more likely to develop epilepsy, reports a Taiwanese study, which found a strong relationship between the two diseases. BBC Epilepsia The 20th of September, U.S. researchers say they have demonstrated how fuel cells powered by bacteria can be self-powered and produce a limitless supply of hydrogen for hydrogen cars. BBC PNAS the 22nd of September An international team of scientists at CERN records neutrino particles apparently traveling faster than the speed of light. 
If confirmed, the discovery would overturn Albert Einstein's 1905 special theory of relativity, which says that nothing can travel faster than light. BBC Arxiv. A non-disease causing virus kills human breast cancer cells in the laboratory, creating opportunities for potential new cancer therapies, according to Penn State College of Medicine researchers who tested the virus on three different breast cancer types, Pennsylvania State University. The 24th of September, NASA's Upper Atmosphere Research Satellite (UARS) deorbits and impacts the Pacific Ocean, having been decommissioned in 2005. UARS, which was launched in 1991, was designed for the study of Earth's atmosphere, particularly the ozone layer. NASA. The 26th of September, researchers have demonstrated that electrons can move freely in layers of linked semiconductor nanoparticles under the influence of light. This discovery may assist the development of cheap and efficient quantum dot solar cells. NAT. Nanotechnol. The 27th of September. Scientists have successfully replaced an injured part of a rat's brain with a synthetic substitute. New scientist Sense Foundation. Scientists have created a nanostructure which can multiply stem cells used in therapies, a first step towards developing large-scale stem cell culture factories. LabMate Online Nat. Meta. The 29th of September. A rocket carrying China's first space laboratory module, Tiangong-1, is successfully launched, marking the start of the Tiangong Space Station program. BBC A new method for self-healing materials is presented, inspired by mammalian vasculature, BBC J. Roy. Sock. Intif Geothermal power plants could help produce lithium for electric cars, by way of a new process which extracts lithium from the brines used to generate electricity in a geothermal power plant. Scientific American The 30th of September Scientists release the most accurate simulation of the structure of the universe to date, YouTube, Astrophys. J. Boston Dynamics unveils its AlphaDog military transport robot, a larger, faster and quieter version of its BigDog prototype. The legged robot can carry up to 400 pounds of cargo, and is designed to support infantry in rough terrain. TechCrunch October 3 October the 2011 Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine is shared by Bruce Beutler of the United States, Jules A. Hoffman of France and Ralph M. Steinman of Canada posthumously, for their research into the human immune system. App via New Zealand Herald BBC. The Atacama Large Millimeter Array in Chile, the largest and most complex radio telescope ever built, begins operations. BBC. 4 4th of October, the 2011 Nobel Prize in Physics is shared by DR's Adam Rees, Saul Perlmutter and Brian Schmidt for their discoveries relating to dark energy. New York Times. The 5th of October, the 2011 Nobel Prize in Chemistry is awarded to Professor Dan Schechtman of Iowa State University for the discovery of quasicrystals. New York Times. A form of cloning has been used to create personalized embryonic stem cells in humans, according to American researchers, BBC, Nature. The 6th of October, a smart pill has been developed that is able to record accurate information about internal conditions in the gut, such as acidity, pressure and temperature. The Yorkshire Post. The 7th of October, data from the ESA's Venus Express probe reveals that the planet Venus has an ozone layer in its upper atmosphere. BBC The 10th of October UK doctors report that the antibiotic normally used to treat gonorrhea is no longer effective, because the sexually transmitted disease is now largely resistant to it. BBC HPA Exercise is equally effective at preventing migraines as drugs, a Swedish study suggests, cephalalgia. The 12th of October The genetic code of the germ that caused the 14th century Black Death has been reconstructed by scientists for the first time. 
The British researchers extracted DNA fragments of the ancient bacterium from the teeth of medieval corpses found in London, BBC Nature. Ginger supplements may boost digestive and colon health, according to a new study. Los Angeles Times Cancer Previous. Res. 13 October, silencing a protein known as BCL11A can reactivate fetal hemoglobin production in adult mice and effectively reverse sickle cell disease, according to a new study. Medical Express Science. The 14th of October. Seven vehicle manufacturers in Europe and the US have agreed to adopt a standardized, universal charging system for electric vehicles. New scientist Ford. Using carbon nanotubes, researchers have created artificial muscles that can twist 1,000 times more than any similar material made in the past, a development that could prove useful in robotics and prosthetic limbs. Technology Review Science. The 16th of October, for the first time, researchers have found a way to inject a precise dose of a gene therapy agent directly into a single living cell without using a needle. The technique uses electricity to fire therapeutic biomolecules through a tiny channel and into a cell in a fraction of a second, NAT. Nanotechnol The 17th of October, the world's first commercial spaceport, Spaceport America, is opened by Virgin Group Chairman Richard Branson in the U.S. state of New Mexico. The Spaceship 2 spaceplane is expected to begin commercial flights from the spaceport by 2013. BBC the 18th of October, the World Health Organization reports that global malaria deaths have fallen by 20% since 2001, claiming that over 30 countries are on course to eradicate the mosquito-borne disease by 2020. The fall in deaths is believed to be the result of improved diagnostic technologies and wider use of malaria vaccines. BBC WHO a malaria vaccine has shown promising results in a clinical trial in Africa, BBC, NEJM. Europe's highest court, the European Court of Justice, has ruled that stem cells from human embryos cannot be patented, in a case that could have major implications for stem cell research and regenerative medicine. BBC Spanish engineers have developed a machine that uses artificial vision and UV rays to scan through citrus fruits and detect rotten ones. BBC Food Bioprocess Technol Joseph Fourier University have developed a biofuel cell that can generate electricity from glucose and oxygen. This could allow patients to power their own medical implants. BBC The 19th of October British computer chip designer Arm unveils the Cortex A7 processor which should allow manufacturers to make cheaper and more efficient smartphones. BBC Imperial College London researchers have shown logic gates can be built out of E. coli bacteria and DNA. This could be used to make sophisticated diagnostic cells that assess and treat illness in the body. NAT. Commune. The 21st of October. The Earth's surface is undeniably warming, according to a detailed new analysis by an American scientific group. BBC Berkeley Earth Project. Further research has been published suggesting there is no link between mobile phones and brain cancer. The latest study looked at more than 350,000 mobile phone users over an 18-year period. BBC BMJ. The first two satellites of the Galileo Satellite Navigation System are launched from Guiana Space Center by the European Space Agency. The Galileo system is intended to reduce Europe's reliance on America's dominant global positioning system GPS, Bloomberg, ESA. The 24th of October, India's Minister of Health, Ghulam Nabi Azad, reports that the country has almost entirely eradicated polio through a vaccination program which immunizes over 170 million children every year. No new polio cases have been reported in India for over nine months. BBC. The 25th of October, human DNA may carry a memory of living conditions in childhood, according to a new study, Science Blog, Int. J. Epidemiol. Space telescope observations indicate that the supernova RCW86, first seen by Chinese astronomers in 185 AD, expanded at an unprecedented rate due to the formation of a vacuum-like 
cavity around it in the early stages of the death of its star. The expansion of the supernova, which was visible even in daylight when first discovered, has remained a mystery for nearly 2,000 years. BBC Astrophys. J. The last of the United States B-53 nuclear warheads is disassembled near Amarillo, Texas. The 9-megaton bomb, which first entered service in 1962, was formerly the most powerful nuclear weapon in the country's nuclear arsenal, possessing nearly 600 times the yield of the Little Boy atomic bomb that destroyed Hiroshima in 1945. New York Daily News 26 October the Boeing 787 Dreamliner, a composite-based airliner with up to 20% greater fuel efficiency than previous models, completes its first commercial flight for all Nippon Airways, after a three-year production delay. BBC American scientists confirm that an infectious fungus, Geomyces destructans, is responsible for the incurable white nose syndrome that has decimated bat populations across North America since 2006. BBC Nature Scientists at the University of Hong Kong have found that the cosmic dust permeating the universe contains complex organic matter, described as amorphous organic solids with a mixed aromatic aliphatic structure. Such organic matter could be created naturally, and rapidly, by stars. Space.com Nature The 27th of October Researchers in Oxford, England, begin human trials of a pioneering gene therapy technique, which is hoped to provide a cure for crippling ocular defects such as retinal choroideremia. BBC New measurements reveal that the dwarf planet Eris is almost identical in size to Pluto, which was deemed to be a dwarf planet in 2006. Wired ESO 28 October British scientists report that a daily dose of aspirin can reduce the incidence of bowel cancer in people at high risk of the disease. BBC The Lancet Human-caused climate change is already a major factor in more frequent Mediterranean droughts, according to a new study, which shows that the magnitude and frequency of drying is too great to be explained by natural variability alone. NOAA J. Klim NASA launches the NPOESS preparatory project, the first of its next generation of polar orbiting satellites dedicated to gathering weather and climate data. BBC NASA. The 29th of October, CERN researchers attempt to repeat a recent experiment that apparently yielded faster than light neutrinos, using a more efficient system of measurement to validate their results. The Guardian. The 31st of October. The world population reaches 7 billion, according to the United Nations. The Guardian November 1 November India announces plans for a prototype nuclear power plant that uses thorium, an innovative, potentially safer nuclear fuel. The Guardian Scientists have transformed age-worn cells in people over 90 including a centenarian, into rejuvenated stem cells that are indistinguishable from those found in embryos. Medical Express Gene Dev 2 November China's unmanned Shenzhou-8 spacecraft robotically docks with the orbiting Tiangong-1 space station module, marking China's first orbital docking, and a major milestone in its efforts to construct a full-scale space station by 2020. BBC American researchers delay, and in some cases even eliminate, the onset of age-related symptoms such as wrinkles, muscle wasting and cataracts in mice. The development may have significant implications for the study and treatment of such symptoms in humans. BBC Nature. Morocco is chosen as the first location for Desertec, a German-led 400 billion euros project to build a vast network of solar and wind farms across North Africa and the Middle East, with the aim of providing 15% of Europe's electricity supply by 2050. The Guardian. The 4th of November. Six men emerge from the 520-day Mars 500 isolation experiment, which aimed to simulate a manned mission to Mars. 
The experiment, undertaken at a Moscow scientific institute, was intended to investigate the isolation of long-duration spaceflight and its effects on the human body and mind. BBC A 20-year-old alternative solar cell design using dye-sensitized nanocrystal cells DSC could lead to cheap, printable cells, revolutionizing solar power use worldwide, according to a new study. Kurzweil I J. Am. Chem. Sock. The 5th of November An American doctor claims that brown eyes can safely and permanently be turned blue by using short laser pulses to destroy pigment in the iris. BBC An official White House report states that The U.S. government has no evidence that any life exists outside our planet, or that an extraterrestrial presence has contacted or engaged any member of the human race. It furthermore asserts that there is no credible information to suggest that any evidence is being hidden from the public's eye. Although odds are pretty high that there may be life on other planets, the odds of us making contact with any of them, especially any intelligent ones, are extremely small, given the distances involved. Universe Today White House the 6th of November, dopamine-producing brain cells that are killed off by Parkinson's disease have been grown from stem cells and grafted into monkeys' brains by American researchers, in a major step towards new treatments for the condition. The Guardian Nature. The 8th of November, the asteroid YU55 makes a close Earth flyby, passing within 0.85 lunar distances, about 201,700 miles, of the Earth. YU-55 is approximately 400 meters 1, feet across, and is the largest asteroid to make a close pass since 1976. Another comparable flyby will not occur until 2028. BBC Russia launches the Phobos Grunt probe, marking the nation's first attempt at an interplanetary mission since 1996. The mission's goal is to obtain samples from Phobos' surface and return them to Earth in 2014. The Chinese YINGHU-01 probe, China's first Mars exploration spacecraft, is also launched. However, despite reaching orbit successfully, the two spacecraft are left unable to begin their journey to Mars, due to the failure of a secondary engine to ignite. Space.com BBC Honda revamps its humanoid robot, Asimo, giving it enhanced artificial intelligence, the ability to move without being controlled by an operator, and a greater capability to cope with different situations. USA Today A Scottish-designed bionic leg exoskeleton, designed to allow handicapped people to walk, is approved for sale in the United Kingdom, BBC. The 9th of November Dutch scientists build a nanoscopic electric car, made of a single complex molecule, capable of traveling small distances when an electric current is applied to it. Though currently at a rudimentary level of development, the invention may have applications in the fields of nanorobotics and molecular machinery. BBC Nature A team of scientists in Japan synthesize the world's first stem cell-derived pituitary gland. Technology Review Nature if current trends continue, Earth will almost certainly suffer a mass extinction of species, according to a major new survey of 583 conservation scientists published in Conservation Biology. Conserve. Biol. The 10th of November. No wild black rhinos remain in West Africa, according to the latest global assessment of threatened species. BBC IUCN. British computer chip designer ARM unveils its latest graphics processing unit GPU for mobile devices. The Mali T658 offers up to 10 times the performance of its predecessor, and may start to appear in devices towards the end of 2013. BBC ARM a method of communicating with brain-damaged patients who appear to be in a vegetative state is discovered by scientists in the UK and Belgium, BBC The Lancet. The 14th of November A study of heart failure patients treated with their own stem cells has achieved striking results and could result in the biggest breakthrough in a generation, Daily Telegraph The Lancet 
Scientists have used brain scan images to create the world's first movie of the female brain as it approaches, experiences and recovers from an orgasm. The Guardian Neuroscience 2011 The 15th of November 95% of adults worldwide now own cell phones, according to a new study, Market Watch. British doctors report that they have cured a baby boy of a life-threatening liver disease using implanted cells which acted like a temporary liver, allowing the damaged organ to recover. The cell implant technique, developed by researchers at King's College Hospital, London, is described as a world first, BBC. American researchers report that the recharge speed of lithium-ion batteries can be significantly enhanced by making millions of tiny holes in them. The discovery could lead to laptop and cell phone batteries which recharge 10 times faster and hold a charge 10 times larger than current technology allows. BBC ADV. Energy Meter. The 16th of November. Police in Northern Ireland consider the use of airborne surveillance drones to combat crime, following the adoption of such technology by other UK police forces. Canadian drone manufacturer Arian Labs is cited as a potential supplier. BBC Intel debuts an accelerator chip capable of running at speeds of one teraflop at a supercomputing conference in Seattle. The device, dubbed Knight's Corner, combines 50 individual processor cores into a single chip. BBC Intel A report commissioned by the state of New York warns that future Hurricane Irene-like storms could put a third of New York City under water and flood many of the tunnels leading into Manhattan in under an hour, due to the effects of climate change. The Guardian NYSERDA Scientists report that estimates of the rate of amphibian population decline are too optimistic, and that populations could decline even faster than previously thought. The Guardian Nature The 17th of November Researchers at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology design a computer chip that mimics the way that the human brain's neurons adapt in response to new information. BBC MIT PNAS China's unmanned Shenzhou 8 spacecraft returns to Earth after successfully docking with the orbiting Tiangong-1 laboratory module. The Man Shenzhou 9 and 10 follow-up missions are expected to visit Tiangong-1 in 2012. BBC For the first time, astronomers have produced a complete description of a black hole. The American team conducted precise measurements using ground and orbit-based telescopes, allowing them to reconstruct the complete history of the Cygnus X-1 object from its birth some 6 million years ago. Astrophys. J. The 18th of November. A team of American engineers claims to have created the world's lightest material, a microlattice of metallic tubes 100 times lighter than styrofoam, with extraordinary energy absorption properties. The new material may have applications in the development of next-generation batteries and shock absorbers, BBC Science. Opera physicists conduct a follow-up experiment which confirms their earlier observations, first reported on the 22nd of September 2011, of neutrinos apparently exceeding the speed of light. New York Times Arxiv. The U.S. Army Space and Missile Defense Command successfully tests a new hypersonic weapon system, capable of striking targets 3,700 kilometers (2,300 miles) away in under 30 minutes. The weapon was developed as part of the Prompt Global Strike Program. BBC American scientists develop an ultra-thin, ultra-flexible brain implant with resolution 50 times greater than was previously possible, designed to monitor epileptic seizures. The device could revolutionize epilepsy treatment and lead to a deeper understanding of brain function. Technology Review Nat. Neurosci. 19 19th of November, a computer system able to read scientific papers in a similar way to humans promises breakthroughs in cancer research, according to scientists at Cambridge University. Called CRAB, the system is able to trawl through millions of peer-reviewed articles for clues to the causes of tumors. The Telegraph. The 22nd of November, Washington University scientists successfully trial a new generation of contact lenses capable of projecting images in front of the eyes. Human trials are expected to follow the successful animal trials. BBC 
23rd of November, a study published in Nature shows that recent melting of Arctic sea ice is unprecedented on a historic timescale and cannot be explained by natural processes alone. The 24th of November, Japanese researchers have developed a way to illuminate tiny, hidden tumors with a fluorescent spray. Within minutes, doctors can track down residual cancer that has spread and scattered throughout the body, helping to ensure that no tumors are left behind during surgery. Smart Planet Psi. Transil. Med. The 26th of November, NASA's Mars Science Laboratory mission successfully launches for Mars. The mission landed the robotic Curiosity rover on the surface of Mars in August 2012, whereupon the rover began its search for evidence of past or present life on Mars. Chicago Tribune launch video 4 o'clock. The 28th of November, an American carbon capture and storage (CCS) project begins a three-year trial to pump 1 million tons of CO2 underground. Click Green (MGSC). Swiss researchers are developing magnetic nanoparticles that could be used to remove harmful substances from the bloodstream. Technology Review The 30th of November Researchers at Washington State University develop an artificial bone scaffold which can be produced using 3D printers, potentially allowing doctors to quickly print replacement bone tissue for injured patients. BBC as the Arctic warms, thawing permafrost will release greenhouse gases faster and at significantly higher levels than previous estimates, according to survey results from 41 international scientists. Nature December 1 December, Oxford University researchers successfully entangle 2 mm scale diamonds using controlled laser pulses. This represents the first known instance of quantum entanglement in objects large enough to see with the naked eye. Nature News Science. The 2nd of December, scientists suggest fluorovium and livermorium as names for the newest additions to the periodic table. BBC Researchers have created an advanced fuel cell which could give electric cars greater range, while keeping CO2 emissions low. Technology Review Researchers from the London Centre for Nanotechnology LCN discover a property of graphene that could widen its applications in nanotechnology. The team of scientists observed the surface of graphene sheets and found a series of ridges on the material, which could improve understanding of superconductivity. The engineer, 5 December NASA's exoplanet hunting Kepler mission confirms its first extrasolar planet in the habitable zone of a Sun-like star. The planet, Kepler 22b, is around 2.5 times the size of Earth, and may have a surface temperature of 22 degrees Celsius, making it potentially suitable for terrestrial life. BBC NASA New research suggests that at least three quarters of the rise in average global temperatures since the 1950s is due to human activity. The age Nat. Geosci. American scientists report the discovery of the two largest supermassive black holes known to science. The two black holes each have a mass nearly 10 billion times greater than the Sun BBC Nature. German researchers have demonstrated a graphene-based transistor array that is compatible with living biological cells and capable of recording the electrical signals they generate. The engineer ADV. Mater. The 6th of December, when climate data is adjusted to remove the impact of short-term factors such as El Niño Southern Oscillation, volcanic aerosols and solar variability, the global warming signal becomes even more evident, according to a new study. Environ. Res. Let. The 8th of December. NASA's Opportunity Mars rover finds veins of gypsum on the surface of Mars, strongly implying the presence of liquid water on the planet. BBC. Spanish researchers unveil a process which allows highly complex shapes to be carved into nanoparticles, potentially revolutionizing medical tests and drugs treatments. BBC. Science. 9 December, biologists at Tufts University coax tissue to grow a new organ by simply altering the membrane voltage gradients of cells. 
In the experiment, tadpoles were made to grow new eyes outside of their head areas. Development The 13th of December Plumes of methane, a greenhouse gas 20 times more potent than carbon dioxide, are observed bubbling to the surface of the Arctic Ocean by scientists surveying the region. The Independent Researchers at the Large Hadron Collider report that the elusive Higgs boson may have been glimpsed during particle collisions. BBC 14 December MIT scientists develop an imaging system capable of capturing images at 1 trillion frames per second fast enough to image individual light waves traveling through space, MSNBC Microsoft co-founder Paul Allen and aerospace engineer Bert Rutan announced plans to develop a commercial spaceflight venture, dubbed Stratolaunch Systems, using a giant carrier aircraft to launch rockets from the upper atmosphere. The first unmanned test flights of the system are expected to begin in 2016. Huffington Post The 15th of December American researchers extend the lifespan of fruit flies by up to 50% by tweaking genes in the fly's intestines, Gizmag cell metabolism. Columbia University researchers publish a survey, began in 2003, revealing that same-sex marriage improves the health of gay men overall. The study recorded a reduction in depression, blood pressure issues, and stress-related disorders. The reaction of lesbians was not studied. BBC Am. J. Public Health The 16th of December Chinese engineers demonstrate a chemical coating, based on titanium dioxide, which allows cotton clothes to clean themselves of stains when exposed to sunlight. ACSAPPL. Meta. Interfaces. The Energy Saving Trust EFT reports the results of a trial of LED light fittings in social housing in the United Kingdom. The LED fittings offered significant improvements in efficiency over traditional light fittings, and also proved more popular with residents. The EFT predicts a substantial market share for LED lighting by 2015. BBC EST Brown University engineers reveal a system that can efficiently remove traces of toxic heavy metals from water. The technique is reportedly scalable and commercially viable. Chem. Eng. J. The 17th of December, American researchers report advances in solar cell efficiency, using quantum dot technology to capture additional electrons from photons striking solar panels. CNET. Science. 19 December, scientists at the University of California report a major breakthrough in the cultivation of drought-tolerant crops, PNAS. 20 December, scientists operating the Kepler Space Telescope report the discovery of the first truly Earth-sized extrasolar planets, Kepler 20e and Kepler 20f, orbiting a sun-like star, Kepler 20, NASA, Nature, a potential new malaria vaccine has shown promise in animal studies, according to Oxford University researchers. The team plans to start safety trials in human volunteers, following lab tests which showed the vaccine to be effective against all known strains of malaria. BBC Nat. Commune Canadian scientists win approval to start human trials of an experimental HIV vaccine. The STAR the 21st of December Researchers at the University of Notre Dame reveal an inexpensive solar paint that uses semiconducting nanoparticles to capture solar energy. ACS Nano According to a study published in PNAS, the introduction of non-native snakes into southern Florida swamps has devastated the population of small mammals in the region, with sightings of species such as raccoons declining by 99% since 2000. Davidson Herpetology Laboratory PNAS. The 22nd of December China conducts its 18th successful orbital launch of 2011, marking the first year that more Chinese than American spacecraft were launched. Wired University of Texas researchers report that solar cells can be made to yield more energy by exploiting a so-called shadow state of photons, doubling the number of electrons that may be harvested in the process. The discovery could allow the theoretical maximum efficiency of silicon solar cells to be increased from 31% to 44%.
Gizmag Science American researchers unveil self-repairing electronic chips that can repair broken circuits by releasing microcapsules of conductive liquid metal. BBC ADV. Meta Harvard University researchers develop a method of supercooling that could generate the lowest temperatures yet achieved on Earth, potentially aiding the creation of quantum computers. BBC Nature Researchers at CERN's Large Hadron Collider LHC report the discovery of a new particle, dubbed CHIB 3 p The discovery marks the LHC's first clear observation of a new particle since it became operational in 2009. BBC Arxiv. The 27th of December China activates its Compass Satellite Navigation System, a rival to the American Global Positioning System GPS, offering navigation services on the Chinese mainland. The system, also known as BEIDOU-2, is expected to offer global coverage by 2020. BBC China unveils a prototype high-speed train capable of reaching speeds of over 310 miles per hour, 500 kilometers per hour, the first ultra-high-speed train developed by China without the aid of international partnerships. Financial Times, the 29th of December, South Korean researchers begin the development of microscopic robots capable of entering human blood vessels to treat illnesses. The microbots, which measure just one millimeter in diameter, are steered and propelled by externally induced magnetic fields. Innovation News Daily The Wildlife Trade Monitor Group traffic reports that more ivory was seized in 2011 than in any year since 1989. Around 23 tons pounds of ivory, representing at least 2,500 dead elephants, were intercepted in 13 operations, mostly in shipments intended for the Asian market. BBC Traffic Chemists at Harvard University report the creation of a self-assembling artificial cell membrane, formed from an oil-detergent emulsion mixed with copper ions. 31 December, NASA's GRAIL-A satellite enters lunar orbit, to be joined the following day by its twin, GRAIL-B. The two spacecraft will map the Moon's gravitational field in unprecedented detail, with the aim of improving scientists' understanding of how the Moon formed. NASA Prizes <inaudible> 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 Topic Abel Prize 2011 Abel Prize, John Milner Topic Nobel Prize 2011 Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine, Bruce Beutler, Jules A. Hoffman and Ralph M. Steinman 2011 Nobel Prize in Physics, Saul Perlmutter, Brian Schmidt and Adam Rees 2011 Nobel Prize in Chemistry, Dan Schechtman Deaths January <deaths> 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 1 January, Louise Rees, American physician, coordinated the Baby Tooth Survey B. 1920. 3 January, Anatoly Skorokhod, Ukrainian mathematician B. 1930. 4 January, Jack Richardson, British chemical engineer B. 1920. 5 January, Jack Ertel Oliver, American scientist, provided seismic evidence supporting plate tectonics B. 1923. The 8th of January, Willy Dansgaard, Danish paleoclimatologist and geophysicist. B. 1922. The 17th of January, Shinichiro Sakurai, Japanese automotive engineer. B. 1929. Bernard Crossland, British engineer. B. 1923. The 18th of January, John Herivel, British historian of science and former cryptanalyst, b. 1918. The 9th of January, Ernest McCulloch, Canadian hematologist, pioneer of stem cell science, b. 1926. 
The 25th of January, Daniel Bell, American sociologist, B. 1919. The 31st of January, Charles Kaman, American aeronautical engineer, B. 1919. Topic: February. The 2nd of February, Rodney Hill, British mathematician, pioneer of plasticity theory, B. 1921. The 6th of February, Ken Olson, American engineer, Digital Equipment Corporation founder, B. 1926. The 8th of February, Bradley C. Livesey, American ornithologist, B. 1954. The 10th of February, Oleg Lavrentiev, Soviet physicist, B. 1926. The 11th of February, Christian J. Lambertson, American physician and engineer, developer of the first scuba device, B. 1917. The 13th of February, Nobutoshi Kahara, Japanese engineer, lead worker on the Sony Walkman, B. 1926. Shi Yafeng, Chinese geographer and glaciology expert, B. 1919. The 15th of February, Charles Epstein, American geneticist and Unabomber victim, B. 1933. The 17th of February, Richard F. Danes, American physician and health official, B. 1951. The 19th of February, Anson Rainey, American scholar of Near East history and linguistics, B. 1930. The 20th of February, Frank A. McClintock, American mechanical engineer, B. 1921. The 21st of February, Edwin D. Kilborn, American research scientist and influenza vaccine expert, B. 1920. The 26th of February, Zhu Guangya, Chinese nuclear physicist, helped develop China's first atomic bomb, B. 1924. Topic: March. The 1st of March, John M. Lounge, American astronaut, B. 1946. The 3rd of March, Venkatraman Radhakrishnan, Indian astronomer, B. 1929. James L. Elliott, American astronomer, discoverer of the rings of Uranus, B. 1943. The 4th of March, Simon van der Meer, Dutch Nobel physicist, B. 1925. Chester Kahapi, American soil scientist, known as the face of Hawaiian statehood, b. 1945. Alan Ushtarian Armenian Iranian astronomer and physicist, b. 1920. The 5th of March, Alberto Granado, Argentine founder of the Santiago School of Medicine, b. 1922. The 6th of March, Marie Andre Bertrand, Canadian criminologist, b. 1925. The 8th of March. Victor Manuel Blanco, Puerto Rican astronomer, b. 1918. Araj Afsha, Iranian scholar and bibliographer, b. 1925. The 11th of March. Donny George Yuhana, Iraqi archaeologist and anthropologist, b. 1950. The 13th of March. David Rumelhart, American applied psychologist, b. 1942. The 14th of March. Leslie Collier, British virologist, B. 1921. G. Alan Marlett, American addiction medicine pioneer, B. 1941. The 17th of March. Murdoch Mitchison, British biologist, B. 1917. The 19th of March. Robert Ross, American physician and educator, founder of the Ross University School of Medicine and the University of Medicine and Health Sciences, B. 1918. The 21st of March. Bohumil Fizer, Czech cardiologist and health minister, B. 1943. The 23rd of March. Teodor Nogoita, Romanian polar explorer and scientist, B. 1947. Jean Bartik, American mathematician and ENIAC programmer, B. 1924. The 25th of March, Thomas Eisner, German-American entomologist and pioneer of chemical ecology, B. 
1929. The 26th of March. Paul Baran, Polish internet pioneer, B. 1926. Harry Coover, American superglue inventor, B. 1917. Topic: April. The 2nd of April, John C. Haas, American chemical engineer, B. 1918. The 3rd of April, William Prusoff, American pharmacologist and early AIDS drug pioneer, B. 1920. The 5th of April, Baruch Samuel Blumberg, American Nobel physician, B. 1925. The 6th of April, F. Gordon A. Stone, American chemist, B. 1925. The 9th of April, Jerry Lawson, engineer, American video game pioneer, B. 1940. The 12th of April, Janis Polis, Latvian pharmacologist, B. 1938. The 14th of April, William Lipscomb, American Nobel chemist, B. 1919. The 21st of April, Harold Garfinkel, American sociologist and pioneer of ethnomethodology, B. 1917. Max Matthews, American electrical engineer who arranged the synthesized musical accompaniment for Daisy Bell. B. 1926. The 22nd of April, Merle Green Robertson, American archaeologist whose drawings were used to crack the Maya script. B. 1913. The 30th of April, Daniel Quillen, American mathematician. B. 1940. Topic May. The first of May. Stephen A. Orsorg, American mathematician, B. 1943. J. Ernest Wilkins Jr., American nuclear physicist, B. 1923. The second of May. David Sensor, American physician and former director of the CDC, B. 1924. The 3rd of May, Robert Brout, American-born Belgian physicist, B. 1928. The 5th of May, Leslie Ordis, British botanist, B. 1911. Salomon Hakim, Colombian physician, B. 1929. The 6th of May, Horace Freeland Judson, American science historian, B. 1931. The 7th of May, Willard Boyle, Canadian Nobel physicist, B. 1924. The 8th of May, Corwin Hanch, American chemist, B. 1918. The 9th of May, Henry Pfeffer, American surgeon, B. 1918. The 11th of May, Morris Goldhaber, Austrian-born American physicist, B. 1911. The 12th of May, Noreen Murray, British molecular geneticist, B. 1935. Jack Kyle Wolfe, American electrical engineer, B. 1935. The 19th of May. David H. Kelly, American-born Canadian archaeologist, B. 1924. Tom West, American computer engineer, B. 1939. The 20th of May, Steve Rutt, American engineer and early pioneer of video animation, B. 1945. The 26th of May, Erwin D. Mandel, American dentist, B. 1922. The 28th of May, Leo Rangel, American psychiatrist, B. 1913. John H. Sinfelt, American chemical engineer in unleaded gasoline, B. 1931. The 30th of May, Rosalind Sussman Yallow, American physicist and winner of the Nobel Prize in Medicine, B. 1921. Topic: <laughs> June. The 3rd of June, Jack Kevorkian, American pathologist, advocate of euthanasia, B. 1928. The 8th of June, Anatoly Abragam, Russian-born French physicist, B. 1914. The 11th of June, James Rahal Jr., American physician, West Nile virus expert, B. 1933. 
The 16th of June Austin Makatalo, Swedish electrical engineer, cell phone inventor, B. 1938. The 17th of June Nathan Sharon, Israeli biochemist, B. 1925. The 18th of June Bob Pease, American electrical engineer, B. 1940. The 20th of June Robert H. Widmer, American aeronautical engineer, B. 1916. He Zehui, Chinese nuclear physicist, B. 1914. The 23rd of June, Christiane Desroches Noblecourt, French Egyptologist, B. 1913. The 26th of June, Robert Morris, American cryptographer, B. 1932. Topic July. The 7th of July, Ricardo Alegria, Puerto Rican anthropologist and archaeologist, B. 1921. The 8th of July, William R. Corliss, American physicist, B. 1926. The 11th of July, Tom Gerrels, Dutch-born American astronomer, B. 1925. The 15th of July, John S. Toll, American physicist and university chancellor, B. 1923. The 16th of July, John Crook, British ethologist, B. 1930. The 18th of July, Rudiger D. Haugwitz, German-born American chemist, B. 1932. The 21st of July, Franz Alt, Austrian-born American mathematician, B. 1910. Harold J. Kosiski, Canadian-born American physician, B. C. 1928. The 23rd of July. Robert Ettinger, American academic, known as the father of cryonics, and a pioneer of transhumanism, B. 1918. Richard Pike, British chemist, B. 1950. The 27th of July. John Rawlins, British surgeon vice admiral, B. 1922. The 28th of July, Max Harry Weil, Swiss-born American physician, B. 1927. The 30th of July, Daniel D. McCracken, American computer scientist, B. 1930. Topic: <laughs> August. The 2nd of August, Baruj Benakaraf, Venezuelan-born American Nobel immunologist, B. 1920. The 6th of August, Bernardine Healy, American physician, B. 1944. The 7th of August, Charles C. Edwards, American physician, B. 1923. Paul Meyer, American mathematician, B. 1924. The 11th of August, George Devil, American inventor of the first industrial robot. B. 1912. The 14th of August, Fritz H. Bach, Austrian-born American physician. B. 1934. The 18th of August, Morris M. Rapport, American neuroscience biochemist. B. 1919. The 20th of August, William B. Cannell, American physician. B. 1923. William the First Wolf, American physician and colonoscopy co-developer, B. 1916. The 26th of August, Patrick C. Fisher, American computer scientist and Unabomber target, B. 1935. The 27th of August, Keith Tantlinger, American mechanical engineer, B. 1919. The 28th of August, Tony Sale, British Computer Museum curator, B. 1931. The 29th of August, Pauline Morrow Austin, American meteorologist, B. 1916. Topic: September. The 5th of September, Angeletta Corradini, Italian astrophysicist, B. 1946. The 6th of September, Bruce B. Dan, American physician, B. 1946. The 9th of September, Valentino Breitenberg, Italian neuroscientist and cyberneticist, B. 1926. 
the 14th of September Rudolf Mossbauer German Nobel physicist B 1929 the 16th of September William Hawthorne British aeronautical engineer B 1913 the 17th of September Julius Blank American mechanical engineer B 1925 the 20th of September Oscar Handlin American historian B 1915 the 21st of September Michael Julian Drake American astronomer B 1946 the 22nd of September Margaret Ogler Kenyan physician B 1958 the 23rd of September Carl Wood Australian physician B 1929 the 24th of September Richard Koch American physician advocate for phenylketonuria neonate screening B 1921 the 25th of September Wangarai Mathai Kenyan veterinary anatomist and Nobel Peace Prize winner B 1940 the 26th of September Robert Blink Slovene physicist B 1933 the 27th of September Wilson Greatbatch American electrical engineer and the inventor of the implantable cardiac pacemaker B 1919 the 28th of September Pierre Dansereau Canadian biologist B 1911 the 30th of September Lee Davenport American physicist B 1915 Ralph M Steinman Canadian Nobel immunologist B 1943 topic October The 1st of October, J. Willis Hurst, American physician, B. 1920. The 3rd of October, Aidan Meinl, American astronomer, B. 1922. The 5th of October, Steve Jobs, American computer engineer and technology entrepreneur, co-founder of Apple Inc., B. 1955. The 8th of October, Milan Puska, American pharmaceutical executive, B. 1934. The 11th of October, Bob Galvin, American electronics executive, B. 1922. The 12th of October, Dennis Ritchie, American computer scientist, B. 1941. The 14th of October, Morris Chaffetz, American psychiatrist, B. 1924. The 23rd of October, Herbert A. Hauptmann, American mathematical biophysicist, winner of the Nobel Prize in Chemistry, B. 1917 the 24th of October John McCarthy American computer scientist and cognitive scientist B 1927 the 30th of October David Utz American surgeon B 1923 topic November The 2nd of November, John F. Burke, American physician, B. 1922. The 4th of November, Norman Foster Ramsey Jr., American Nobel physicist, key contributor to the atomic clock, B. 1915. The 22nd of November, Lynn Margulis, American evolutionary biologist, B. 1938. The 25th of November, T. Franklin Williams, American physician and specialist in geriatrics, B. 1921. The 28th of November, Lloyd J. Old, American physician, B. 1933. Topic: December. The 5th of December, Paul M. Doty, American biochemist, B. 1920. The 14th of December, Boris Chertok, Russian rocket scientist, B. 1912. Topic. See also. List of emerging technologies. List of years in science. 2011 in spaceflight.